Hey guys, welcome back to an episode of my Super Mario Galaxy 2 Let's Play. In the last episode, we got some, um, Comet Medals. Or Prankster Comet. Not Comet Medals, but, you know, Prankster Stars. God. Sorry. Prankster Stars and everything. And if you guys don't know, or Prankster Comet Stars. But anyway, we're going to continue getting Prankster Comet Stars and stuff. I don't know why I keep calling them Comet Medals. The like stars and everything, or the stars, the comet medals. I guess it would be the other way, but me, I think it's just confusing because it's, it's they're called pr prankster comets, and I keep calling them like the medals that are in this game. Because I don't know why. Especially uh, at least, at least, yeah, at least I'm not calling them because it's in the first game because they don't even ha they don't even have those medals in the first game. But anyway, guys, welcome back to the to the episode and everything. If you guys don't know already, this is actually, um, post-commentary, again. <laughs> yeah, well, the only reason, like, this time was commentary is actually, technically, just technically, I did, I, like, technically I didn't have a, um, USB cable. Well, I had to, well, for it to record both the gameplay and the commentary was in my mic because it uses the same, but I, but I got one, I got one now, so, for future videos... Hopefully, I can record live. That'd be nice. I mean, I kind of... Well, at least, I guess with Fire Red and Leaf Green, I don't have to use my two of them at a time because the ones I can just record straight from, from my computer when playing Fire Red. But when I play like Galaxy using my capture card, like from a console and everything, I have to, you know, use, <laughs> like, both two different, um... USB cords. I mean, it's the same USB cord. It's just different. Diff it's just different. Um, it's just different cords. Same type of cord, I guess. Just different, exact. Not the same exact one, but but which I got. Like I said, I got it because actually, I had spring break last week. Like I mean, it's Friday now, but I've been in school for a week. So yeah. And also, if you guys don't know, it's been a while since the last episode. It's actually been a while since I even last recorded a video. Like. The weird thing is, I was planning on rec I was planning on recording a lot more over the break. Yeah, it did not happen. Of course, <laughs> not even close because it's already been a week after. The funny thing is, I recorded this game, the gameplay of this, before I went on break. <laughs> and just recording this a week after spring break, so I could have like I could have just recorded the game. Like I know I went home, so I didn't bring. I should do. I did bring my capture card. I just didn't bring my console if I wanted to play Wii games. Even though I do have the Wii U, but I could have bought, but I could have bought the, my Galaxy 2 and play on the Wii U. I mean, I would also have to probably transfer data and everything, and then, and then transfer data back because I have my Wii here. Unless, unless I transfer, unless I bring my Wii back and forth, or if I transfer to my Wii U, bring my Wii U back and forth. Which, of course, the thing is, if I play, if I play Wii U, if I want to play on the Wii U, I can't play my uh, Wii, my GameCube games. That because you know the the Wii is backwards compatible with the GameCube, but the Wii U is backwards compatible with the Wii. So, which I mean, I mean, and I don't want to buy, and I don't think do they? I think I'm trying to. Think, I can't remember. I've been so long since I'm, since I'm playing my Wii U. I think if they even have GameCube games on the on the virtual console or not. But yeah, although that's one thing, that's one thing I do like except about, I like about the Wii U compared to the Switch. The Wii has a virtual console, the Switch doesn't. And also the Switch shop, the Switch shop is like the worst shop i ever seen of any like game, like where you can like just like, like, in, like how the, you have the Nintendo shop and everything. The Wii U sucks. The Switch, this Wii, oh not the Wii U, the Switch sucks. Like. I mean, the Switch is an awesome console, just that version sucks. Just the Switch version of the um, shop sucks. The Wii U is fine. The Wii U is actually pretty good shopping. Like the shop they have on Nintendo Shop. As well as the 3DS is pretty good too, but the Switch... Yeah. I don't, that's like the worst. Like... I'm not even like... I'm not... Maybe, maybe because it's just like... It's hard to find stuff. It's hard to find everything on there, like, or like, cause it's like flooded with a bunch of uh, <laughs> games, uh, like games I never heard of, like a bunch of indie games I never heard of that, like, I'm not really interested in buying. And and when you ever try to look for some, like, something, it's just hard and everything. And 
So like, the, I mean, you can always search for a game. Like, I mean, they do have the search feature, but the but not having but having like just looking at everything is eh, not the best. And also, we got to get this first star to this Goomba. We gave this guy the Goomba, so we're gonna get our first first star in this episode. And also, if you guys don't know, this star. Well, we actually clicked on the first mission of this guy. See, but this, but it had a special star. Because some some of these you can click on the previous mission and have these special stars, like special stars within it and everything. Like this one. Like, which, to be fair, when we recorded, I had no idea it was like this. Like this, but, I mean, when I when I saw the gold guy, I think I knew it was going to be some special star thing, but, because, you know, there's a lot of them, there's a lot of missions, and there's good multiple missions with them where you just collect coins, and you go to, like, a different area and do certain stuff in that, in that or that plan, or on that pl on a different, like, plan or whatever, or, or a different route, or launches you to a different, different route, but that one just had it where the gold, had to bring him the Goomba, and he gives you a gold star, which is kind of, it's, it's an easy one. I guess it's not a prankster comment, but, oh, prankster, yeah, prankster comment, jeez. So I'm not trying to get confused with metal on a comment. Prankster comment, yeah. That's what I was meant to say. Jeez, I don't know why I keep saying it wrong. I have probably, just, I mean, I did that, I remember when I first started this flash play, I, did I call, um, do I call the stars shines? I, I think I, I, at one point, near the beginning of the last play, I think I did. It's weird because I know when as a kid, I used to call the shine stars. Well, technically they are stars. They're not. They're technically called shine sprites in Super Sunshine. So, because I had like a friend who got like mad at me calling <laughs> the, the shine sprites and get sunshine stars. Are, I mean, technically they are. Oh, I'm, oh man, I remember this one. This one. This one actually. This one's actually a pain. I mean, oh yeah, I remember failing at this too. Like, like I said, this is post commentary. Oh, and we also have a timeline. Cause also, when I first did this, like this person right here, I didn't notice that I had a time limit until like multiple seconds. <laughs> I thought, like, I didn't realize I didn't have the timer until like until I got to the crab area, like when I was launching for that to the star, like, cause when I got, cause I went up for the you know level up or or the extra life, and that kind of wasted a, t a ton of time. Oh, and by the way, there was a bunch of can get a bunch of starbits by just you know going through here. We just got another one up anyway, so but yeah, you can um just you know run to all these crabs and and everything, and, and you get a bunch of starbits. And if you run into all of them before the time runs out, which I want on this part in this in white here, but just a small twelve seconds smaller. <laughs> but like yeah, like you guys have if you run into them, you get a, a uh, star. And then, as well as, as well, you get a bunch of star bits. We got, we got so close. We got so close. We had one left. I believe it was. I think it actually happens two times in a row. So, I know I could cut it right here, but I don't. Eh. Screw it. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not doing that in anything. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to cut it. Uh, it's gonna be interesting to see how like this post commentary. And also, I have no sound by the way, so like I can hear the sound. That's why I was like so confused. Is why I was like, did the videos like I know when I was doing the starting this recording section of the doing the comment, I was like, okay, I'm waiting. Where's the? There's no sound, but yep, the sound. I <laughs> eh. see how. I mean, I can always edit out or whatever, or whatever I decide to do, or whatever, or we record if I really want. Probably not. We're gonna record, but yeah, I mean, this this game, this game's. I love this game. God, like, look, like, look, we only got 10 seconds left. Like, this is a pretty, ch um, like, challenging. I this is actually a little challenging. Like, look how, look how close we got. Look how close we got. Like, same thing happened. <laughs> that's the, that's the thing. Is like, why, why, why does it want, to, why does it want to kill me? God, like, look, we had to hurry up and get all these crabs. I don't know why I'm destroying all these crabs. Gives you a star, but apparently it does. It's Nintendo, Nintendo logic. We, we're um, killing a bunch of of crabs. Genocide, the genocide crab. Because we, because we're committing genocide against all the crabs. I mean, that's kind of what we're doing. Like. It's horrible. Like it's definitely horrible because we're killing a bunch of innocent crabs. But or well, that's what they say. 
that I say is innocent, but they're really not. Well, that got a whole bunch of them. Got 19 seconds left. Oh wow, I like, I like how I have plenty of time the third time around, but like the first two, the first two times, I had one left. <laughs> I <laughs> say so, like my, my luck is garbage. And we're about to get our second star in this episode. We got another level up. <laughs> I mean, that happens when you get a ton of star bits. So it's been about eleven minutes. That includes with the intro though too. But <laughs> why that eleven minutes with the intro? The twenty-five second intro that I had for like three years now. <laughs> I think I had it for over three years now. The intro that I have. I know, I mean, I was, th I was thinking when I was originally doing how to make change it every year, but I never did. And there's two of a letter. Or Baby Luma has a letter from the, from, you know, Rosalina and everything. It's just, it's just really like, one thing, one thing I do like about, I mean, why do you like Galaxy 2 better? Galaxy 1, like, had Rosalina. <laughs> I mean, Rosalina is in this game, a tiny, tiny bit, like, more like a cameo and like, men or mentioned, but like, it's this purple blob thing. Like Rosalina. And also I think I like the layout they had in Galaxy 1. Like the layout is pretty cool. I mean Galaxy 2's layout is pretty cool too with the whole map. This giant map and everything. But I think Galaxy 1 had it better. Had like a more interesting where you actually have a like a hub area, giant hub area and go to different, different stuff. Whether it's just how you know a whole map. Which I mean is easier to navigate to get stuff in this game. But it's... But I thought it was more interesting. You know, I do prefer Galaxy 2 overall as a game than Galaxy 1. Also, I find Galaxy 2 a little, a little bit easier. Maybe that's why I like it more. I don't know. But of course, I haven't played Galaxy 1 in so long. Like, I mean, I haven't played Galaxy 2 in a while because I haven't recorded a video in a while. But it's been, it's been years since I played Galaxy 1. Like, I don't even remember the last time I played Galaxy 1. Because I remember, like, playing Galaxy 1, all, like, all the time as a kid. And also... <clears throat> I didn't get Galaxy 2 until like quite a bit, at, like, like, I think like two years or so after it came out. Like Galaxy 2 I didn't get, well like, Galaxy 1 I think I got it like the uh, year that it came out maybe, <laughs> which is when the Wii came out. Well not when the Wii came out, but like around, like shortly after the Wii came out. I think is when Galaxy came out, like cause Galaxy was one, of the, like the first Galaxy game is like one of the latest Wii games, so. I mean it's not as early as like Wii Fit, but. Well, Wii Sports, I guess Wii Sports probably is like the latest. <laughs> Cause it came with the Wii <laughs> when you get it. So, I mean, obviously, it was probably a launch. It definitely was a launch title, Wii Sports. Also, Wii Play was as well. I know they, and it's interesting because I know um, there's also different versions of Wii Sports. Okay, there's a Wii Sports Resort and everything, which I actually never owned. I actually no, never owned Wii I played Wii Sports Resort because I'd like, I just had like, other people that owned, I know other people that owned the Wii and they had the Wii, Wii Sports Resort and that's how I played Wii Sports Resort. But I, as a kid, always played Wii Sports, but never played Wii Sports Resort, which is interesting. It is. I mean, I guess that's how, I mean, that's how it is. Because I grew, I grew up with the, well, well, I kind of more grew up with the GameCube. Like, Wii was kind of like later years, but, but. I still can't, like, still kind of grew up, I kind of grew up still with the Wii. I mean, I guess I was, I'm like, I, mean, I guess I was like 9 or so when the Wii came out, I think it was. But still, like, I think, if that's 2006. I think 2006 it came out, I think, because I know there was games that came out, there was, because there was Twilight Princess that came out in 2006, and that was, I think that was, that was on the GameCube and the, and the Wii. And then it was later, you know, we mashed it for the Wii U, but... Which I have the Wii... I have both the Wii and Wii U version, which is interesting, because the Wii, Wii U version... Oh, the Wii version is flipped. So, like, I played the normal version of, on the... I played the normal version on the on the Wii U, so... The non... non and then, you know, the Wii version is also called Hero Mode, or it's called Hero Mode on the Wii U, but... Which is just the flip version, which is what that that was the Wii and everything. But yeah, like I played, I really played Twilight Princess on the Wii first, and then I played a little like quite. And also, it was interesting because um the Wii the Wii, the sad thing about my Wii my Wii the Wii version for the longest time before I got it on the Wii U before it, well before it came out on the Wii U. Um, Twilight Princess. 
Twilight Princess was one of my first Zelda game. I don't, can't remember. I can't remember. I think it was Twilight Princess that was my first Zelda. I think it was. I can't remember. I think it was Twilight Princess that I got because I had it on the Wii. Then I think I then I eventually got um Ocarina of Time on 3S eventually at, later on and everything. But yeah, like then I got Twilight. Then I got Twilight Princess on the Wii U late, like, even later. Like I got. I think I got. I originally got um. Twilight Princess on the Wii, then it got Ocarina of Time on the 3DS, and then it got Twilight Princess again on the Wii U, and now I have Breath of the Wild, which I, which I mean, had Breath, I Breath of the Wild since like, cause I got Breath of the Wild like when I got my Switch, so, so and everything back in like April 2017. Been about, been about two years since I got the game, since I got um Breath of the Wild. Well, it's been longer since I got Twilight Princess, but kind of which. Still can't believe it's been like three years since I, about since I think I got that. Cause I, I think I got it pretty shortly after it came out. Twilight Princess HD. So, 2016. Well, I used to ask no when I got it, I remember that. Cause I do cause I remember seeing the receipt, like, I think I still have like, or some like, I think I still actually have the receipt in the box. Just cause like, there's, there's some games where I have the still receipt for, which most games I don't have anymore. But I think when I think I remember seeing like a few months ago seeing the receipt in the in Twilight HD case or something like that. I think that's where I saw whatever in it in there. Cause I remember seeing the date, or I just remember seeing a date of like of when I got it. It might not. I mean, it's usually I would assume it would be on the receipt, but yeah, like that's the thing. I think Twilight Princess was my first. Like on the Wii version, and the that thing is the Wii version of Twilight Princess I owned. Like, one thing is I got, I was got to like the first dungeon, and then the game froze, and every time I tried to go f forward, the game froze. So like, every time I go to that, like, start the first dungeon or whatever, it froze. <laughs> so like, I couldn't continue in the game. So I couldn't like. I really couldn't play um, Twilight Tri Princess until um, the Wii U version because, like, my Wii version I had only went through like part of the first dungeon or whatever, or the part where you like. At least I think that's the first dungeon. It's the part where you know you rescue the monkey. I mean, I don't know if that's actually the first dungeon, but or you follow monk or or you. I think no. I think you follow the monkey. I think somewhere or something like that. Can't can't remember <laughs> exactly. Thing is, I'm not that familiar with the Zelda series, so <laughs> just letting you guys know, I'm not that familiar with it. Which I mean, you sh people should know, I'm not that familiar with the Zelda series. Like I I know I don't know that much. I mean, I like I said, Breath of the Wild was my first Zelda game I beat, and like I said, I wasn't the biggest fan of Twilight Princess. I know I'm a well, I mean not Twilight Princess. I wasn't the biggest fan of Ocarina of Time, so that's what I meant. I actually, I actually really enjoyed Twilight Prince of what I played. I played, um, I think I played through the first two dungeons since I got the, yeah, like I said, it's still not that much, like, but, like, Breath of the Wild was my, like, very, like, really my first Zelda game I kind of got into. Like, I couldn't really get into either Ocarina of Time or Twilight Princess, but Breath of the Wild was the first where I got really in into it and everything. And, like I said, I beat in Breath of the Wild, but I haven't beaten Ocarina of Time or Twilight Princess. But Twilight Princess I got farther in than Ocarina of Time. I can't remember where I got... I think I got to that guy's belly. Is where I got in Ocarina of Time. But I think I got through like the first two. A little bit maybe after the first two dungeons. I can't... Well, I beat... I know I beat in the first two dungeons. I think I got a little bit after the second one dungeon as well. can't remember exactly. I, had to, I mean, I had to look back where I and everything. And I don't know much about the new Zelda, the Zelda game, so you said only beat in Breath of the Wild, so but I knew I knew I I knew I beat in two dungeons in Twilight Princess and Ogre in Time, I don't remember. But I know before I got before when I was playing the Wii I it took I still played a few hours of the Wii version when I first got it. Plus I was new at it, so I don't know I didn't know anything I didn't know anything or know where to go. I mean I still don't know where to go really that much or get like lost. I think that's part of the reason why I'm not the biggest fan of, like, the Zelda series. It's like, I don't, like, I'm not, like, that much into it, and I always get lost. And I also don't play it that often, like, when I do, I play it, like, I play it for a little bit, maybe, like, hour or something like that, maybe. Then, like, stop, and then come in, like, at, then come back to it, like, a month later or something like that. 
I mean, that's how, like, and so I forget where to go and what to do and everything. So that's, that's why I had, that's why I didn't really enjoy Ocarina of Time that much. Or even Twilight Princess that much, either. I mean, I enjoy Twilight Princess more than Ocarina of Time, but... Uh, yeah, I just couldn't, just, I think part of the reason, that's the reason I think I love Breath of the Wild, because, like, Breath of the Wild, you don't have to re rely on memory. <laughs> I guess, memory of, of, like, if you... I mean, plus I had no idea who 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 was to and everything. Like he was to like, cause I know I had like a friend who helped me or whatever. It's like he's like, and he and, he, and this time he got mad at me because they tell me where to go, or they told me where to go in the past, but I didn't remember. Cause it's been so long since I played the game, or like, or it's like I don't know where that is. I don't know what that city is or where it's at or who that character is and everything. I had that trouble in, in both Ocarina of Time and Twilight Princess, so... Yeah, like... I, 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 and I still don't... I still wouldn't know and everything. Like... It's kind of embarrassing. But anyway, that's what we're about to get our star here, which we're about to actually end up the episode about what... after we get the star and everything. Just getting a bunch of these, um... Star bits. And everything. And then we get the star right here, which is amazing. But yeah, I think I think I'm gonna stop talking about my Zelda story because I'm pretty much done anyway. And everything with the well, with the video and talking, so with about Zelda, so talk about Zelda and the Mario game. Away, I mean, I, I talk, did talk about Mario in this in this video, like with sunshine and everything. <laughs> but with you know stars or comment bells and stuff and picture comments. Fix the comments. Yeah, and anyway, I think this is the end of this episode. And so I'll see you guys in the next episode. As we probably just can print more stars. So I'll see you guys next time. Green Gamers Game Out. I'm out. Bye bye.